to delete your Hotmail account, go to your browser. In the address bar, just type Outlook. And this will take you to the sign-in page where you need to enter your Hotmail email address and uh, password and then sign in to your Hotmail account. When you're signed into your Hotmail account, go to the upper right side and click on your username and then click on account settings. And this will take you to the Microsoft account details of your Hotmail account which is the same as your Microsoft account. Now on the left hand side pane click on security and password. Sometimes if you haven't verified your Microsoft account it will ask you to verify it first of all with either your mobile phone or the alternate email you provided during sign up uh, before you can access your security and password information. But once you verify or if you had verified before you're going to see the protect your account information then you want to scroll down to the bottom of the page and click on the link that says close my account click on it so just select these check boxes and then select a reason if your reason isn't listed here just select the my reason isn't listed option and then you want to mark account for closure now before you mark this account for closure you should know that after 60 days you'll not be able to recover this account and you will lose access to any Microsoft service that this account is to access. One other thing, before you close your Microsoft account, make sure any devices like your smartphone or your tab or any other PC you use that is signed into this account is signed out first of all before you can deactivate or mark this account for closure. This is because any automatic sign in will reactivate this account. Click on this blue button that says mark account for closure. So there you go. So that Hotmail account will be closed 60 days from now but before those 60 days you can cancel the closure and reopen account by simply signing in to uh, the account. So click on done and your Hotmail account has been deactivated. It will get deleted from the Microsoft servers after 60 days. Thank you for watching. Put your comment, suggestion, opinion or question in the comments box below this video. And don't forget to subscribe and share. My name is Chris with